Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, where today I'm going to do part 12 to my Let's Play of Family Feud 2021 Edition for Nintendo Switch. Now guys, before I get into this video, there's two very important notes that I want to go ahead and tell you before I actually get into it. Um, let me go ahead and tell you guys, this has not been the best day ever. Well, I can say it hasn't been the best day ever, but my day went from just really good to really bad in just a matter of a few minutes. Let me explain, guys. During the last video, in fact, I think yesterday, almost two days ago now, I did part 11 to my Let's Play Family Feud, correct? And some of the videos I did, including the Let's Mostly Play I did sometime afterward, I talked about how the storm mode was coming up on Evo Pop. I, mean, I said Evo Pop, coming up on Castle Crush again. And yes, I did do a video on it. However, I've been promising you guys that we'd actually be able to do another video. I was going to try to get more videos done of it. But here's the ironic twist. Once again, the storm mode shows up. It gets late at night, about 2 3 in the morning. And guess what happened, guys? The exact same thing that happened the last time the storm mode came up. The internet went out again. I don't know why. It is so I don't know why they freak. It keeps going out at the time that it does. It just does. And it irritates the living snot out of me. I don't know what the frick happened to it. I don't know why it's being such a wiener head. But that ruined any plans I have doing anything else. Even if I wasn't going to do Castle Crush. That ruined any plans I have of me doing Brule.io. Soul.io. Heck, maybe even that Dino Lab, Dino Lab game that I've been doing for the last few videos. Because I've been having a ton of fun with that. Through my plans of doing Hungry Dragon or Hungry Shark World. I can't do the games without internet. A lot of the games that I do for my series requires internet to actually do. Which is complete garbage. So, if you're wondering why there hasn't been more than one video of Castle Crush, thank the internet for being a wiener hit every time I try doing a video. I could I realize I could do it earlier in the day, guys. But a lot of time when that happens, I'm either tired, asleep, or I'm worried about getting interrupted in some way. Like, I think I woke up around 7, 8 o'clock today. And, uh, I maybe could have done a video, but do you guys only think I was going to risk bullcrap just to end up having... I don't want to ruin catch anything bad on camera, guys. And, uh, that's one of the reasons why I usually wait till so late to do a video. Either so early in the morning, right before the storm mode comes on, or right after... Or, like, sometime way later at night. It ain't just Castle Crush I do that with. Like, why do you think I do... I Like, why do you think I like to do videos at the Let's Mostly Play of Evo Pop and Soda Island Brew to Iowa on there at that time? It's because I want to be able to have... I want there not be that many people in, um... Brew to Iowa. That way I don't end up getting screwed over. And, uh... Well, I guess every time the storm mode comes up, I'm going to have to make it, I'm going to disobey that rule if I want to actually get more than one video done of it. Because, like I said, the internet, again, just messed up for no reason whatsoever. And I don't know why I keep doing that. I'm going to be very mad if it's still messed up by the time I get done with this two or three hour long video. I only know if it's going to be two or three hours. Well, I said, I wouldn't even plan on coming up here. Heck, I could do a Pokemon video, but remember this, guys, I don't want to be irritated whenever that happens. So, that's why I'm not doing a Pokemon video, even though I, Frogger could, or Frogger could cheer me up, or whoever I decide to, well, whoever's past his turn it is. I only know, I know it's one of the Torterra passes now, but I don't know which one. I think it's the Alvis, but I don't want to be completely wrong. Plus, if I did do it, I wouldn't be having the wheel, because... Well, that kind of leads into my second announcement, guys. I had to, I I had to quit. Well, at least for now, I had to quit using that last charger that I had for my iPad at the time. Now, let me go ahead and say this, guys. My mom had got me a new charger about two, three, four weeks ago, maybe even a month ago, 
but I never got the chance to open it up. Like I've been saying for the last few videos, guys, we were having problems with the battery, we were having problems with the charger itself, and I was hoping that maybe something I could get it to work again. And that's the thing about the purple charger. It was it worked sometimes, it worked flawlessly sometimes, but sometimes it worked like complete junk. In fact, earlier a, a, a few hours ago, actually about 11, 12 o'clock or so, I had the iPad plugged in and I was using it for a few minutes to check on a few things. Actually, here's the thing. I actually left my iPad not in sleep mode and that caused my battery, even though it was plugged in, to go from 90, uh, go from 100 to 99 or 98. And then, about 12 o'clock, or, or sometime I past 12, I actually went to get some of my day rewards in some of the games that I play. Games like Hunger Shark World and Hungry Dragon and all that stuff. However, just doing that for like 2 or 3 minutes brought my battery down to 96. I left it alone, and after I got done doing that, I put it back to sleep and let it charge. But get this, one hour passed, actually I think a little bit more than an hour had passed, and the thing just wouldn't charge. It stayed at 96, it would not go up. So I decided to go ahead and use that new charger my mom bought me. And would you believe it, the first minute or two I plug it in, it goes from 96 up to 97. And then about 20... 20 minutes later, goes to 98. And then, I, I don't even know how long it was. I'd say maybe about 10, 15, maybe 20 minutes after I got done doing that, it went from 97 up to 100. And it's been at 100 ever since. It's not plugged in right now, guys. That's usually odd for me, because usually I like to have the iPad plugged in 24-7. However, I'm going to try getting better. I'm going to try getting better about managing the battery. If it's at 100 and the battery's not going down very slow, or not going down very fast, I will keep it unplugged for a while of the video. However, my plan is the next time I do a video, to let the battery go down to 90, 85, or 80, and then plug in the iPad again, and see if it charges. If it does, then we're in a really good zone. If it doesn't, then maybe we can actually um, use that as a gauge to be able to see when we do the tablet. Although that would also dictate when the video is going to be over, even if the video is only like three or four hours. I mean, granted, you guys, that may sound like a long time, but for me, it really is in some cases. Usually, videos like that are the ones I don't have that much fun in. It'd been nice if I could have gotten more. It'd been nice if I could have gotten the storm mode done, Castle Crush today. But of course, well, internet has to mess up. So, unfortunately, we can't do that. Like I said, I ain't gonna do porn since I'm already in a kind of a bad mood. I'm already in a bad mood because of that. I don't want to. I don't want to hurt Fragger's feelings or whoever I decide, whoever pass out, whatever pass or whatever I decide to use. I don't want to hurt the poor Pokemon's feelings. They didn't do anything wrong, so I don't want to hurt their feelings right now. That's why we're playing a little bit of fame with you guys. I don't know how many games we'll be playing. I really do not know how many games we'll actually be playing of this. What the frick was that? That does remind me real quickly, guys. I meant to go ahead and plug up the computer because it was about to die. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I want to let you know that I went ahead and tried to readjust the brightness again. I don't know if it's as good as the last brightness I had for the game. But it's still you still can see it pretty well. So, yeah. I can't waste too much time with this, guys. I'm irritated that I don't have no internet. I'm in a bad mood because of it. And, uh, well, we're not really going to, uh, be getting too much. We're not really going to be wasting too much time. As you can see, like I said, you can see the game. Again, albeit not the best, but it's better than nothing. The volume's back it down at 35, guys. But once we get past that loud screen with the three Pac Man looking ghosts. I'll turn the volume back up. Well, once you get past that and no those screen right after that one. So, yeah. I'm sorry, guys. The video hasn't been the very best to start off with. But hopefully, we'll, if Family Feud will be able to be something. You know? Hopefully, Family Feud will be able to actually get somewhere. 
Well, I say I want to do more Pokemon. It's just that I hate how much of a bad mood I'm in every time. The as you see throughout, even my Let's Mostly Play videos, guys, you see that I'm in a bad mood very flippin' easily. The little voice of things will set me off, and it ticks me off. <laughs> well, it, it, the little voice of things will tick me off. In fact, that's one of the best reasons why during each video I usually say, especially in the Let's Mostly Play, I say stuff like, "What the gay frick." Go kill yourself and things like that. You guys honestly think I'd want to say that on purpose? Let me go and give you a hint. No, I would never really want to hurt. I would never really want to do anything like that. Like I said, I feel bad for that. Uh, it's just let me go and say I do feel bad for that happening. It's just that things don't work out the way I want it to. Wait a minute, here comes the screen, guys. Go cover your ears. <laughs> Guys, alrighty. I don't know why it took so long to load up this game, but at least it did load up. You guys know the routine, and yeah, you guys can actually see that, which is pretty good. There we go. Uh, alright. I'm sorry, guys. We're not gonna waste too much time, actually. We're not gonna waste too much time. We're going to play a few games of Family Feud and see what happens. Hopefully, things will actually work out. But I don't know. Let's see what happens. Let's play the Family Feud. Yep, let's play. I am uh, make sure the camera was still recording. Which, so far, it looks like it is. I would say I wanna have it I wanna ha I wanna have some fun with this game, but it seems like the last year I did this game, the lead fan was even being a, a freaking uh cheating little piece of crap. I don't know if we things are gonna work out. We'll have to see. Let's go ahead and play against the easy family. We might switch up a little bit more often, guys. However, I don't know how off I don't know how long this video's gonna be quite yet. Anyway, you guys know I'm gonna be very quiet for the host. So, let's play the Family Feud, everyone. Oh, you're up late. You know what time it is. It's time for Family Feud. How you doing at home? I'm Lucky McCoy. Thanks so much for coming here to the Feud. I'm ready to play the Feud. Let's meet the families who are taking on the feud. In a team of one. Yeah, hopefully this thing will work out in my favor. Please let things work. All set with some smooth grooves, it's the leaves. Screw you, Lee family. Now this time, don't cheat. Our families will be battling it out to answer your surveys. Whoever scores the most points goes on to fast money for the chance to win a lot of cash and a brand new car. Okay, let's play Family Feud. It is a little bit dark. I mean, you can see where it's still dark. Let's kick things off with our first round. Wait a minute. I'm going to need one person from both families to join me up here. It is a little bit dark, guys, but kind of deal with it for now. Let's play the family feuds. They're kind of forced to us in the internet. Here we go. I'm going to need six answers, friends. All right, six answers. I'm going to ask you a question, and you need to buzz in first to answer. If you can find what's hiding behind the top slot, you get to choose if your family plays the round or gives it a pass. We conducted a survey of 100 people for this question. Which is? Name a positive side to being unemployed. You're in first. What you got? Free time. Uh, game, don't start this. I just begun. Yeah, free time. Good Understood. Our survey said, free time. That's at the top. Yeah, baby. Now here's the million dollar question. Play or pass? That's the hard part, though. Like, what else would they be? Oh my gosh. 
if they cheat, I, you know what? Pass. This is your big chance. Let's make the most of it. it this might be a bad, to see, a bad idea, but... It's your go. What do you think? Hopefully they don't know anything. <laughs> Parenting. Said with confidence. Okay. Let's see if you're right. Parenting. That's up there. Okay. Nice job. Yes. Yeah. What do you have for us? Uh, no, but yeah. Uh, yes. That's a good one. Is it there? Oh, you're gonna. No boss. Well done. Frick me. This is supposed to be easy, man. I need an answer. Seriously, this is supposed to be easy, but yet... No to me. Interesting answer. Because we're driving, basically. Did our survey agree? No commute. Ding. Ooh! It's not up there. So this is your first strike. Oop. Moving along the feud chain. No taxes. That's what you think, huh? Okay. Only a few answers left. Have you found one of them? No taxes. Oh. I've got another strike on the board. I'm not going to say anything until it's my turn, but I think I have an idea of one. Remember, if you don't get this one, the other family has a chance to steal. Oh, yeah, that's a we good. have an answer. That's it. That ain't the one I was thinking of. Is it up there? Let's hope so. Sleep in. You're still in the game. Yay. Name a positive side to being unemployed. Daytime to Sure thing. I, uh, yeah. Okay. And what did our survey say? Although that fall under. Daytime TV. Dang it! We're still clinging to this game. Well, that's a good answer. This is bad. Why do they cheat? Get another strike, and the other family will get a chance. Yeah, there's only one answer left, though. <laughs> they just took it! Here we go, then. That was mine! Did our survey say it? Welfare! That ain't my answer still. You cleared the board. See what I mean? <laughs> Family. Freak you! All right, let's see where we're at. I am sucking gigantic wiener. The first points of the game are on the scoreboard. I, I wouldn't know everything. Three times was the best. That, that was my answer. I was gonna go with welfare. Get ready to go full Nick Cage because it's time for the face-off. Someone from each family, get up here and play. Please let things go better this time. Oh, man. The top six answers are on the board. Again, okay. Get those buzzer fingers ready. What do you got? We got 100 people to answer the following question. Name an occupation in which you'd be very embarrassed to get a traffic ticket. You're up first. A cop. Okay then. Time to find out if it's up there. Police officer. Answer number one. Yeah, baby. You can play or pass and force the other family to play. Ah. Uh, I'll play it. Your strategy didn't work so well last time. Let's see how playing does for you. Not that good. I have no idea, but I'm scared my passengers are going to steal it again. We need another answer from you. I mean, they can always steal it. They can do a lot of things. I mean, why would it? They can do a lot of jobs. Uh, tra wait, wait, no, I don't think The traffic ward. Truck drivers, a lot of them. That's what you're going with? Yep. Our survey said, Traffic Warden. Uh, I can't wait the police officer. If it's not on the board, you get a strike. That probably counts as uh, that probably counts as that other one. Dig deep and think of an answer. Truck driver did pop up there. 
Wait, what about taxi driver? That's basically a job. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Time to check the board. What do you got? Taxi driver. Ouch. Oh, no. That's your second strike. Uh -oh. Am I an idiot? Name an occupation in which you'd be very embarrassed to get a traffic ticket. What kind of people deal with traffic? I like a firefighter or a paramedic? Filmmaker? No! Paramedic. Answer accepted. Could it be there? <laughs> paramedic. Ooh, that's your third strike, folks. This is not good. We're throwing out a lifeline to the other family. I don't know why they know everything, man. It's just that they do. They get every time. Just steal the points. All they've got to do is find one right answer. Find a good answer, and you'll get all the points. That's good. If that pops up, and let's see if that's a good answer. If that pops up, tell you never know. Truck driver. That's what we were looking for. You are a cheater. Congrats. This round is yours. Let's tidy up those pesky missing answers. Are you serious? For number six, we have mayor. Oh, I guess. This answer is judge. I was thinking a lawyer. Please reveal number four. And I was even thinking of a courtroom. Clown. Why clown? What was the third answer? Bus driver. Bring more driver. Here's what the scores look like after that round. I'm not doing good. One of our families hasn't got on the board yet. Woo! At least we can stop cheating and that would maybe lead to getting some luck. Are you ready for a face-off? I'm ready to win something. I need a contestant from each family, please. Yeah. Please let me win or come on, please. You're supposed to be the easy family. You're not easy. You can't give me a chance. We want the top four answers to this question. There's only four. Whoa, things are getting hot in here because the points in this round are doubled. 100 people gave us an answer to this question. Which is? Name a reason people change their names. Go for it. They don't like their name. Uh, I see if don't pops up there. Don't like it. Yes. Oh, okay. Our survey says... Dislike name. Yeah. We've got a right answer, but it's not at the top. And now it's your guess. Oh, wait, I know. Okay. I know a good one. Show me the answer. Hiding. Hiding. Really? You found the number one answer. You want to play, or do you want to pass and force them to play? I only know one good answer to this one now. I kind of hope they pass it, though. The other team is giving you a chance to play. I'm surprised. Although I only have one. Marriage. Put on your thinking cap. It's time for an answer. Uh, or... Uh, yeah. yeah. Feeling lucky? Hope so. Is it up there? Show me. Marriage. You're doing great. Yeah, but I'm not last one. You can do it. What do you think? Uh... <laughs> Forced? That's right, I see what I'm doing. I have no clue. I... No, it's not. It's worth a shot. I heard all of them boo me. I heard somebody say that's Have you found the missing answer? Let's find out. I don't know what that... Uh, all I knew was marriage. Nope, not up there. 
So here's your first strike. Ah. Uh. Guess what? We need an answer. Uh, uh, oh, fleeing. Uh, there he said hiding, but he like stop my fleeing the country to be an answer. Flying fish. Running from the law. Oh my gosh. I I don't know. Alrighty then. I don't know last one, baby. And is that the answer we need? No. I don't know what that last one is. Strike two! Okay, people. Let's be careful here. You can still do it. There's no way they're gonna get that fourth answer. I swear to freak, if they do, they're cheating. You got another answer? That are the smartest people in the world, but you think that'd be the King family, not these frickers. This is supposed to be the easy family in the game where I'm getting killed. I'm getting screwed over by them. You're passing on this one. If my life depended on- Oh, oh. Uh, like my friend Al Capone used to say, I know the family has a chance to steal. If my life depended on winning this game family, I'd have been dead already. All they've got to do is find one answer on the board, and they can steal the round. <sighs> Name a reason people change their names. And I hope you don't know it, idiot. Bang. Yep. Um, I want to see that answer. That's going to be it. Bang. Bang. Oh my gosh! That's not the one. Finally! You win! So the points go over here. There's only one answer left over. Number four, show yourself. Which is? Divorce. Oh! Let's find out who's in charge. I'm winning now, but only by a few. Holy moly, we got ourselves a battle here. A new meeting family. Yeah, now if I'm just keep it. It's time for another face-off. Let's do it. Let's get someone from each family down in front. I'm Ray. We've got a full board of eight answers this time. Holy crap. Point values are tripled now, so it's still anybody's game. You got it. We took a survey of 100 people, asking them, name a song that every little kid knows. You got in first. Oh my gosh, I'm song like an idiot. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Oh, right. Yes. Could it be up there? Let's find out. Twinkle, twinkle, little star! That's at the tippy top of the board! What's it to be? Pass or play? I'm lost out and I'm an idiot, but I'll try some. We are playing over here. Yeah, I just hope that things can actually work out for me. What do you think? We need another answer. ABCs? Yeah. That's your answer! The survey says... Alphabet song! Yeah! Good work! Nice! Ring around the rosy! Time to search your mind for an answer! Uh-huh! Ring around the rosies! Yes! Yeah. Is it... are those ring Good. around... Okay! Let's see if that's a correct answer. Ring a ring of roses! You hear that noise? That's a strike. Ouch. Do you have an answer for us? Mmm. Um. <laughs> that could be a wild. My, my mind's already drawing a blank. What's a kid? Rockabye baby? I don't know. Ro I see where you're going with this. Did any of our 100 people say it? Row, row, row your boat! Good job, buddy! 
Holy crap. Ah. Name a song that every little kid knows. Maybe Pop Goes the Weasel? No. Um. London Bridge? I'm trying to lose on the bus. All right. Do we have a right answer? What? Ouch. Another strike. What answer do you have for us this time? I'm going to go with the other one that popped up there. I don't know what that is. As far as I want it, but I don't know what this song even is. Got it. But okay. Show me that answer. This land is your land. Yes, so. I don't know what that song is, so. Oh, no. Strike three. The yeah. other team oh, is in with a chance. Actually, I think even if they get this, is actually, what they have to win a hope not. All we need is one right answer, and this family can steal the points. If this answer is up there, you take the points for this round. Uh -huh. Are you sure about that? I Itty Winty's. What did our survey say? And that was Itty Bitsy. Itty Winty Spider. Itty Bitsy. You cracked it. And I end up with the win. And we got ourselves a winner. It's time to take a look at what we didn't find. Let's see number eight. Jingle bells. Oh my gosh. Come on, seven. Happy birthday to you! Dad, damn it! What was six? Old McDonald had a farm! Son of a feast! We want to see three! Mary had a little lamb! Frick! Let's see how the scores look. I was even trying to get some more nursery rhymes. It looks like we're going to have to play one more round. Yeah, I need to win this. Oh, it's a game over. The winning team needs to hit 300 points. It's time to decide this game. Batten down the hatches. It's time for a sudden death. Let's play sudden death. Can I have someone from each family join me, please? Yes. I'm ready to play the feud. This time, I just want you to give me the top answer. All right. Whoever buzzes in first gets a shot at finding the answer. If you're wrong, your opponent gets a chance. We asked 100 people this question. Name something that piles up when there's a new baby in the house. You buzzed in first. What the hang is it? Diapers. Yeah. Got it. Let's run with it. Nappy. There you go. There it is. You've won! Our solo superstar is going on to fast money. Time to say so long to the leaves. Oh, yeah, baby! Buckle up for some big bucks. It's time to play fast money. Since you're playing alone, you'll be answering twice. Be easy for you, Geminis. Let's go. I'm going to ask you five survey questions in a limited time. Then I'll ask you the same questions again. If you can score 200 points altogether, you'll win the jackpot. Let's go. Box all set. Let's go. All right. Name something some people cheat at. A test. Name something you see at the circus. Clowns. Name something a bank robber needs to do his job. Ski mask. Bag. Okay. Tell me something kids come home from the beach with. 
Beach ball, it's a beach ball for some reason. Now, ball. Name a reason someone might tell you to close your eyes. Soy. We're all questioned out. There we go. All right, let's see how you do the second time around. You need to answer the questions again, but this time make sure you say something you haven't said already. I'll try. Okay, start the clock. Name something some people cheat at. I'll pass. Name something you see at the circus. Uh... Wait, animals, animals. Okay, over, over. Trapeze. There it is. Name something a bank robber needs to do his job. A bag. Tell me something kids come home from the beach with. Towels. Name a reason someone might tell you to close your eyes. Uh, surprise. Ah, on. Name something some people cheat at. Uh, I have no clue anything but test. I'll take job interview. That's everything. There we go. Everyone take a breather. That's all the questions. Oh boy. Let's see how well you did. Uh, hopefully things worked out. First up, we asked, name something some people cheat at. And here's what you said. Both of these answers are looking strong. We got one good answer this time. I was testing Taxes! Oh. That would have been the best answer. I don't test Question me. two. Name something you see at the circus. The answers you gave. These answers are looking good. A top answer. Good going. In the world. You remember the third question, right? It was, name something a bank robber needs to do his job. The answers to this one, I think you can be pleased with those answers. Both answers pick up the points. Good work. Let me guess, bank. What do you think the top answer was? Bank. Weapon. Oh. <laughs> For this question, we asked, tell me something kids come home from the beach with. Here are your answers. I want to 106. Let's see what our survey said. Nice work. That's a top answer. Here's your last question. Name a reason someone might tell you to close your eyes. Your answers were... Oh, no. I need 70. That's the final question. What did our survey say? I need 71. Awesome. Yes! What an incredible game. I cannot believe that. That jackpot is all yours. $20,000 in your pocket. We'll see you next time, folks, on The View. Good night. That worked out. Come on, you're not going to leave it like that, are you? How about a rematch? Heck yeah, I had a lot of fun with that. You know, it didn't work out the best for me. We're on for a rematch. Let's go. Welcome to your wonderful weekend of Family Feud! It's me, Lucky McCoy, and I can't wait to get feuding again! Please make some of the questions easier this time. Let's remind ourselves who's playing. And defending their crown, it's me.
I barely won. When it's a sudden death, I would have lost. They got second place last time. Now, they're back. With their eyes on first. You know the rules by now. Answer our surveys and try to guess the most popular answer. Surveys ready? Let's roll! Now, let's do the face-off. Let's do it. I'm going to need one person from each family to join me right now. Let's play the feud, baby. There are four answers you need to find. When you have an answer to our survey, buzz in as fast as you can. Whoever finds the top answer first gets to decide if they want to play or pass. We asked 100 people to give us an answer to this. Which is? Name a place where you see hands in the air. Think you got something? Concert. Yeah. Okay, sure. Let's see what the survey says. Concert. It's correct, but there's a better answer out there. What do you think? Name a place where you see hands in the air. Okie dokie. That's a good one. Survey says... Sporting event. It's up there, but it's not good enough to win the face-off. So, are you going to play or pass? Might be a grab, but let's try it. We're on the lookout for another win. Let's get to it. Wait, maybe school because... Are you ready? I need an answer from you. That might have been number one to begin with. School. All right, let's try it. Is that answer up there? School. Really? Uh-oh, it's not there. And that means you've got yourself a strike. Let's hope you haven't run out of ideas yet. Oh. Might not be there, but what about her? Understood. Is that one of the ones we've got left? Church. Oh. We're nearly there. It's just number one. Yeah. Uh. Name a place where you see hands in the air. Oh. <gasps> Amusement park. Oh, nice. Said with confidence. Let's take a look. Amusement park. Yes! And that, my friends, is how you clear the board. The points go to this family. All right, it's time for a score update. We've only played one round so far, and this game is already blowing the roof off the studio. Yeah. Let's play another game. Let's do it. All right, people, get up here and do your families proud. I love these. There are five answers on the board. Let's do it. Get ready to buzz in. We took a survey. 100 people. Name something parents hope their child has done by the time they're 30. You're first. What's your answer? Maybe a lot of things. Move down. Ah, yes. Is it on the board? Move down. It's a good answer, but there's still a better one to be found. What will you go for? Interesting answer. Hmm. Let's see if it's up there. Travel. Sorry, but no. I don't know who Let's make up your mind time. Pass or play. This seems like a bad idea again, but I'll try it. Let's pass it. They're passing. 
It's your play now. Yeah, let's hope I don't regret that choice. I know one answer, but that's it. Give me an answer. That's that's what you think, huh? Let's check the board and see if it made it. Bought car. Strike one. Two more and you're out. I mean, would that be something the one I have? I have an idea, but... I bet you've got a great answer for us. Uh... Oh, yeah. We have an answer. Did you be in college before? The survey said... Whatever. College. We got you up there. Oh, that's nice. Oh. Yeah. Name something parents hope their child has done by the time they're 30. <laughs> sure thing. I'm sure some parents won't want that. Will that be one of the missing answers? Had children. Please don't be there. That's correct with a capital K, which means it's there. But there's still a better one. Cool. Good. We're still looking for two more answers. Uh -huh. Oh, here we go then. That's a good one. Our survey says Mary. That's number one. And number three. Yep. Top of the board. Oh yeah. Do you have an answer? We're in the cool. Okay then. Uh, Is this the last answer we're looking for? Please don't. Learn to cook. Uh, yes! That's your second strike right there. Oh, you're so close. You just need one more answer. Yeah, but you also get two strikes. That's what you're going with? If that's not fair, I have an idea. Is that the last answer on the board? It probably is. Career. Dang it. It's a clean sweep. Congratulations. Freak. Are you ready to see the scores? Let's reveal. Dang it. Now we're losing. With two rounds gone, the scores are looking tight. things going with the face-off. Let's do it. One person from each team. Come down and join me here at the front. Let's play, baby. There's four answers for you to find. You got it. Interested in doubling your money? Because now everything is worth twice as much. We asked a hundred people the following. Name something you get rid of when it no longer looks good. You're up first. Uh, what do you got? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Nice. That's a good one. Let's see if it's there. Clothes. Dang it. Perfecto. Do you want to play or pass? We're going to play it. The other team chickened out on this one. Really? Well, I don't have much of an idea either. We need another answer from you. Right. My car. Great answer. answer accepted. Let's check the board. Car. You failed to find an answer, which means you get your first strike of the round. Uh, dig deep and think of an answer. Oh, wait, I know one. Food. Or not. That's good. Let's see if the board's got it. Food. Two strikes. Our other family needs to get ready to steal. Look, we've got two strikes. We've got to be careful. No. Uh, what about... 
we're still looking for? House. Uh, oh no, that's strike three. The other uh, family has a chance. We need another one to get it too. We just need one answer. And if it's on the board, the round is yours. If your answer is on that board, you'll steal that money in the bank. <laughs> Okay. That's one count. Let's see it. Yeah, that's number two. Couch. Dang it! That's not what we're looking for. You're the big winner this round. Let's check out the missed answers. How about the fourth answer? Hair. Wow. Want to see number three? I sure do. Wallet! Huh! What was answer number two? Again, so most of all, what a spare. Spouse! Oh my, I was thinking wife or husband, but... Let's take a look at the current scores. I'm actually in the lead right now, surprisingly enough. Now we've got a new point leader. Wow! I want these nine three points to win. You ready for another face off? Yes. I need two people up front. Yeah, I'm ready to play the feud. <laughs> Let's do it, baby. This time you've got six answers to find. Now the points are worth triple, so this game is still up for grabs. In not? our survey, we asked 100 people. Name something you might buy your father for Father's Day. You're in first. Tools. Yeah. Feeling lucky? Oh, Do we have it? I thought I was a little kid though. Tools. Oh, I know, duh. Uh, Dang it. No. Uh -huh. Can you find the top answer? It's still up there. It's worth a shot. Frick! And our survey says gift certificate. Ding. Uh, huh. Nothing for that one. Card. Chocolate. The top answer is still up there. Think you've got it? I don't know if I got the top answer, but I'll have maybe an answer on the board this time. Card. Nice. Alrighty then. Is that answer good enough? Cards. There we go. We found an answer. You won the face off, so tell me, play or pass? Might be a bad idea, but you know, I'll try. So, still feeling confident after that last round? I like that. Let's play. I don't know many, but. Put on your thinking cap, it's time for an answer. Um... Chocolate? Okay, let's try candy then. Oh my gosh, the one I did have, the one that... And what I had think did anyone in the survey say this? Pet. Uh, That's not on the board. So you've earned yourself a strike. Oh no. What? 
You can do it. What do you think? Deodorant. Let's try tie. Yes. Is it up there? Tie. We are on top. There we go. Name something you might buy your father for Father's Day. Ah! A coffee mug, that's yeah. a good one. Hey, come on, That's okay. your answer! I'll try that one too. Our survey said Coffee mug! Uh, that's a good That's another oh. strike. Guess what? We need an answer. Come on, I'll go with that one. Yeah. Good. Okay. Let's see if you're right. Cologne. I got bad news, folks. That's three strikes. Great. There's an opportunity to steal here. One answer will do it, and they can steal the round. Here's your chance. You can do it. What do you got? Shirt. Oh, I see where you're going with this. You try to close the wall it's not. It's Is it enough. there? Shirt. Ding. You've done it. We've got a win over here. What were our leftover answers? The sixth most popular answer. Gadget. Let's see what's behind number three. Nothing. <laughs> Show me the second most popular answer. That's hilarious. Socks. So, where are we with the scores? No, we got three points yet. Stick around, folks. No one's reached the magic 300, so we get to play another round. Oh, yeah. Neither team has surpassed 300 points, so that means we need a decider. Let's fly in the face of danger and play Sudden Death. I want to play Sudden Death. All right. Give me two people. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All we need is the top answer. Ready those feuding fingers? All you need to do is buzz in first and give me the top answer to win this round. You got 100 it. 100 people. We asked them the following. Which is? Name a reason you might tell your boss you deserve a raise. You're first on the buzzer. What you got? Work hard. Oh, work white. Project work. All right. right. Did our survey agree? I'm gonna work hard. That's but... not up there. I... Man, should put hard. your answer? Man, should put hard worker. Off and got it. What? And what did our survey say? What? Offer a new job. That better not. Thank you. Unlucky. Got another answer? I'm going hard worker then. There we go. Hard working. Are you sure about that? Yeah. Did our survey say it? Hard working. There you go. Correct answer. You did it. You've done it. All by yourself, too. Well, it's time to say goodbye to the lovely Lee family. They're not lovely. They are not lovely, I can assure you that. It's time to go for the big no in Fast Money. Since you don't have any teammates, you'll be playing Fast Money twice. I'm 
going to ask you five questions. I need you to give me the most popular answers. You'll do it once, then we'll come back around and do it again since you're all on your own. Get more than 200 points, and you're taking home the jackpot. And here we go. Name something the Flintstones had that was made from rock. Car. Name something people take with them to the basement when a tornado is coming. Food. Name a person you don't necessarily like, but are obliged to get along with. Mother-in-law. Name a good reason for a man to give his wife flowers. Anniversary. Besides a flea market, name another kind of market. What supermarket count is that? We're done. There we go. Okay, it's time to do it all again. Now it gets a bit tricky. You've got to do it all again with brand new answers. Your time starts now. Name something the Flintstones had that was made from rock. House. Name something people take with them to the basement when a tornado is coming. Oh, uh, I know. Kids. Family. Kids. Name a person you don't necessarily like, but are obliged to get along with. Boss. Name a good reason for a man to give his wife flowers. Valentine's Day? Besides a flea market, name another kind of market. This time, but I'll try that. We're all out of questions. Not a bad idea, but I'll try. Okay, you've done all you can. It's time to find out if you've hit the jackpot. I hope I did. For starters, we asked. Name something the Flintstones had that was made from rock. What did you say? Those answers look good, don't they? Yes. The number one answer. For question two, we asked, name something people take with them to the basement when a tornado is coming. You answered, these two are looking good. The top answer. Next, we asked you, name a person you don't necessarily like but are obliged to get along with. And your answers? You ought to be happy with those answers. I am. That's a tough yeah. answer. Great job. Holy crap. Question four, we asked. Name a good reason for a man to give his wife flowers. You said. Oh, my name's 22. That's two strong answers right there. Oh, yeah, 22. Got good it. on you. We got it. You won the jackpot! Let's quickly see how the rest of your answers shaped up. The $20,000 is yours! Well played, everyone. All right, folks, we'll see you next time for more beauty. Take care of yourself. Good night! Yes! Let's play one more of the Easy Family. Want to go again? You know what? I'll do one more with the Easy Family. Let's play the feud! It's all like King Kong. Rematch time. It's back-to-back -back shows on Family Feud today. And who's your host? It's still just little old me, Lucky McCoy. Yep, let's play the feud, Lucky McCoy. Let's reintroduce our families. Hello. Hoping for another win, I bet. Oh yeah, I'm hoping for another win, but suddenly doesn't mean the only reason I've been winning. 
looking to settle the score. Which again, I hope they can't do. Here's a quick rundown on the rules. I'll ask you a survey question, and you try to guess the most popular answers. Are you ready for action? Yep. It's time for a face-off. Let's go. I want two contestants to come and play. Yeah, let's play the feud, baby. Let's go. We've got four answers to find. Buzz in first to get a shot at answering our survey. If you can find the top answer, you'll choose if your family plays or passes the round. We've got answers from 100 people for this question. Name a kind of building that has many beds in it. You're up! Hotel. Got it. Time to find out if it's up there. Hotel. It's the number one answer. Time to decide, play or pass. It's going to be bad, but I'll try it. You want to take this one off. What do you think? We need another answer. Hospital. Okay, sure. Our survey said hospital. All right, way to go, kiddo. I'm out of jail. Just two answers left to find. Okie dokie. Is that one of the remaining answers? Jail! Look at that beautiful board. Almost full. Oh. Mm. Just one answer left. Yeah, I'm following you with that last one to Roy's. Motown, Motown, we sang that. Wait, a house? Wait, that would be a kind of building. Uh, what about a college? Or a college dorm? No. Ah. I'm gonna go retirement home. All right, let's try it. Time to check the board. Uh, it isn't there. First strike. But you still got this. I know it. I don't know what the last one be. Um. Name a kind of building that has many beds in it. I have no clue what that last one is. Isn't there a job that has in that wild bed? I have no clue what that last one is. A train is a building. I don't know of anything else. And that's a pass for you. Got it. I have no clue what that last one is. We're on a razor's edge here. What? Wait, would a mansion count? I'll try a mansion. Most mansions have a lot of bed. Or not. I have no clue, man. 
I'm gonna pass. I don't know. Her. Well, you couldn't think of anything. Okay. I'm sorry. I don't know that last. This round yeah. is getting thrown over to the other side. And they're gonna steal it because they always do. Most that time anyway. All we need is one answer, and this family can steal the round. If it's up there, you steal the points. If not, they go to the other family. I don't know what that last one will be. What if you be an idiot when I see it? Understood. If that pops up, but not. Could it be there? That is not. Shared house. No. Thank you. Oh, no. Yeah. You win this round. We've got one answer left to reveal. Show me the third answer. Shelter. Oh, okay. How are our families doing? Let's see. That's only the first round. Let's keep moving. Nowhere near as painful as it sounds, it's the face-off. Let's do it. Who's playing this time? Get yourselves over here. Let's play the feed for round two. We've got five answers up for grabs. You got it. Stand by your buzzers. Here we go. We asked 100 people. Which is what? If you were arrested, and could make only one phone call, whom would you call? Your first. Parents. Mother, father, uh, no. Parents. Yeah. Said with confidence. Let's see if that's a good answer. Parent. You found a good answer, but it's not the best answer. Let's see if you can find the top answer. I don't think I know what it is. Ah, uh, yes. That is a very hard Our survey says. Sibling. You gave it a good try, but it doesn't beat the answer already there. So what's the deal? You gonna play or pass? It might be down your own play again. You think you can do this one? Okay. Time to search your mind for an answer. Spouse. Interesting answer. Show me the answer. Spouse. We found the most popular answer. Uh oh. Do you have an answer for us? Little friends. Yeah, friends. That's what you think, huh? There aren't many answers left. Is it there? Friend. Hello. You, you almost cleared the board. Who will be the last one? Aha. Who else might be close to? Only one answer left. Let's go find it. We have an answer. There's no ask the last one. Will this make a clean sweep? Let's find out. Boss. What is that last one? That's your first strike. Two more and you're done. Uh-oh. Grandparents? If you were arrested and could make only one phone call, whom would you call? Grandparents? Grandparents. Yeah. Sure thing. Is it up there? Show me. Grandparent. No. Uh-oh, two strikes. Our other family better get ready. Uh -oh. What are the kids? It's all up to you now. No pressure, but if you miss this, that's all she wrote. 
kids, but the only person I can think of to be close to somebody. Not even having kids. Or not. I have no clue what that last one is. What would happen to Sun? Here we go then. I want to see that answer. Sun! I don't know what that last one is. And that's your third strike. You know there are steel. We yeah. could be about to witness a steal. I actually lost him that game, but that was a lot. Seriously. If this family finds just one answer, they'll steal the round. Okay, if the answer is there, you'll steal the points. If not, they go to the other side of the stage. And where's the answer you're going to go with? Maybe. Okay, then. I mean, you have to have a close one. Could it be up there? Let's find out. I don't want that last one, baby. Neighbor. There's no one. Yes! That's not it. That's two in a row for y'all. Keep it up. Just the one answer left over. Let's see number three. Lawyer! Oh! Before we start another round, let's find out who's on top. Right now it's still me. Don't feel so bad about a big fat zero. Look at it this way. If you end up with nothing, you don't have to pay any taxes on it. <laughs> yeah! oh, Time to go head to head. It's the face off. I want two people to join me over here. Let's go. You want three answers this time. There's not that many. Time to raise the stakes. We're doubling the points. You got it. We conducted a survey of 100 people for this question. Name something you keep within reach when watching television. You're in first. What you got? Remote. That's what you're going with? The survey says... Remote control! That's worth the most points. Decision time, will you play or pass? I'll try it. I guess you want to keep that hot streak going, huh? Let's play that. We've got two answers left on the board. Drink. Food. Nice. Let's see if that's a correct answer. Snacks! Ooh, we're so close to completion. Ooh. What answer do you have for us this time? Okay. <laughs> Answer accepted. There's no way. Is that the final answer? No. Guns. Please don't carry my pants. Yeah. Oh. Um, it's okay. not on the board, so you've earned your first strike of this round. Then why you tell me something keep close by you? Are you ready? I need an answer from you. Thank you, Andrew and Rachel, for watching television. Mobile phone! That's good. Probably just put phone, but. Have you found the missing answer? Let's find out. Phone! Yes! And that board is clear. I got it! Whoa! Look at you storming ahead.
and we finally run out of rounds. So, what are the final scores? This time we got our sudden death. We have a winner. Who needs a family to win this game? You're going on to fast money. The Lee family fought real hard, but unfortunately, it's time to say goodbye. Good. Down to Irvine time. Time to cash in quick. It's fast money. All right, my lonesome lovely. Since you didn't bring anyone with you, you're going to have to answer these questions twice. I've got five questions for you. Give me the most popular answers to pile up the points. Since you're all alone, you'll be answering twice. You need to get 200 points or more to bring home the top prize. Okay, let's start the clock. Come on, guys. Name something about going on vacation that's a big hassle. Name something that many people neglect when they've just fallen in love. Ah! Name an occasion where you see people crying tears of joy. Wait, I messed this up already. What is the first thing you would do after your partner proposes to you? Name something people use for security. Gun. Name something about going on vacation that's a big hassle. Money. Name something that many people neglect when they've just fallen in love. That's everything. All right, I think that thing. Let's give it. these another whirl and see how you do. Right. Time to step it up a gear. You're gonna answer them all again, but this time with different answers. I wish it were. Start the clock. Let's see. I'll I'll check that one. Name something about going on vacation. That's a big hassle. Traveling. Okay, um... Ah! Name something that many people neglect when they've just fallen in love. I have no clue. Name an occasion where you see people crying tears of joy. Maybe a baby shower? No. I just cry sporting over here. What is the first thing you would do after your partner proposes to you? Accept. Name something people use for security. Nine. Name something about going on vacation that's a big hassle. Figuring out where to go. Name something that many people neglect when they've just fallen in love. I don't know what this. I uh, try another. Name something about going on vacation. That's a big hassle. I don't know what you're That's all five. Okay, well that happened. Well that happened. Let's see what this says. That's it. There's nothing more we can do now. How do you think you did? Let's find out.
For our first question, we asked, name something about going on vacation that's a big hassle. You said, you should feel confident with these answers. Why do you Points say all that? around for these two. Question so, the mark. top answer, packing. Our second question was, name something that many people neglect when they've just fallen in love. This is what you said. Is it in our survey? At least one of them got some points. Friends. Oh. That was our top answer. Question three. Name an occasion where you see people crying tears of joy. These were your answers. Those look like some mighty fine answers. Yeah. Number one answer. Ooh. Number four. What is the first thing you would do after your partner proposes to you? Let's remind everyone what you said. Two impressive answers here. We found the most popular one. The final thing we asked you was, name something people use for security. So here's what you said. I need 61. And our final survey said, ah, shoot, that ain't enough points to win the big money. Oh, no, no, you didn't no, do enough no. to win the top prize this time. Dang, you didn't win the $20,000. But we can still give you some cash. Yeah. We're going to add your fast money score to the points from the previous rounds and turn them into cash. Do you know why it's messing up? Thanks for playing, and I hope to see you again soon. Goodbye. Come on, guys. So, are we going to do this again? Or should I head back to my dressing room? I'm going to go to the table lane. There we go. It just said, we, like, I said we, like I said in the beginning of the video, we've been having problems with the internet. She just said that it was back on, but we don't know if it's staying on. And she said that the last few times it went in and out. Do you mean today it's been going in and out over the last few weeks? Alright, it says the internet's back on guys, but I'm scared to even trust it. It's supposed to be, I'm, but if I want, it's supposed to be to do an actual video, but I don't know. Somebody else. We haven't done that in a while. Let's try it. Let's go like this. I was, I was just randomly doing it so I can see how it works with the whole family. Again, we're just gonna try to see what happens. You know what? I did say we only do one more with the easy family, but since we're playing against a whole bunch, since we have a whole bunch of, we'll do this and maybe if we have time for it. It's time for family feud. Yep, let's play one more. Game. Let's do it. It's me, Lucky McCoy, the super host that boasts the most. Alright, man, we'll do one more, we'll get a little 400, I don't know. Are you ready to meet our families? Yes. So he says. These folks are looking lean and mean. I can tell they're going to put up a good fight to win today's jackpot. Please welcome the Lee family. Our 
two families will compete head to head, trying to guess how the American population have answered our surveys. The family who does the best goes on to play fast money and has the chance to win twenty thousand dollars. All right, all right, computers, let's play. <laughs> Let's do it. Hope you've got your game faces on because it's time for a face off. Can I have a person from each team join me over here? Yep. I'm going to need three answers this time. Oh dear. Be sure to buzz in when you've got an answer to the survey question. If you're first to find the number one answer, you get to decide if your family will play or pass the round. We got 100 people to answer the following question. Name a place where it's inappropriate to crack jokes. You're up first. You know. yeah, right oh, okay. Did any of our 100 people say know. funeral? Hey. Numero uno. Are you going to play or are you going to pass? This. Ah, uh, let's try passing it. They're handing it over. This is your chance. I, where else would it. I'm going for the idiot. Two answers remain. Okay. Do we have a right answer? Grandparents. That's gonna put a dent in your game. Yeah, I think I'm not one, but there's two answers still up there. What do you got right. for me? Oh, yeah. Feeling good. lucky? That's a good one. Show me that answer. That's definitely there. Court. The board is almost clear. This is not good. It's your turn to guess. Uh, it's worth a shot. Uh, oh, what end. did our survey say? Library! Uh, uh, there we go. Oh no, you struck out again. If you get this, the money in the bank is yours. If not, the other family might steal it. All righty then. No. And is that the answer we need? No. Dinner party. No. Next. Dang, that's three strikes. Sorry, folks. I'm gonna try school. It's time for the other team to have a crack at this. I'm gonna try school. Now the other family only need to find one answer, and they can take this round. Name a place where it's inappropriate to crack jokes. School. Yeah. Yep. Let's run with it. School. Really? You didn't find what we wanted. This round goes to you. But you knew that, didn't you? You've got just one answer you missed. The number two answer is... Work! I'll... What are those scores doing? That could be anywhere. Seriously. I'm not going to say who I'm rooting for, but their initials are... What is this? your game faces on because it's time for the face off who's gonna join me up here I need someone from each family let's do it I want you to give me four answers to this one get those feuding fingers ready whoever buzzes in first gets a shot at the question 100 people gave us an answer to this question. Name something you do to set the mood when you bring a date back to your place. Go for it. 
White candles. Yes! Let's see what the survey says. Candles. It's up there, but it's not the top answer. The number one answer is still a secret. That's your answer. Survey says... Rose petals. Ooh. That's not what we're looking for. So what do you say? Pass or play? Let's do it any more try. This time they want to play. Have you got some view for thought? Good. Okay. Let's take a look. Dim lights. Hey. It's up there. Got a guess ready? Because I'm going to need one. Uh -huh. oh, yeah. I see where you're going with this. Is it on the board? Uh, Eating. Uh, That's not up there. So here's your first strike. Play some romantic oh. music. Name something you do to set the mood when you bring a date back to your place. Yeah, great answer. All right. Only a few answers left. Have you found one of them? Music! That, my friend, is the top answer! Woo! There's only one answer remaining. Use the move. Ah. Very terrible. Yeah, I don't know what the frick it is, man. Ah. Okay. Let Got it. Let's see if it's up there. Recipe. I was trying to think of music, but... Three strikes. That's going to do it for you. The other family gets a chance to steal. If they can find just one answer, this family will steal the board. You've got a shot here. Are you sure about that? Three. Let's check the board and see if it made it. Romantic movie. Ding. They couldn't do it. goes to you. There's only one answer left to show. Let's see number four. Offers a drink. Oh. Show me those scores. This is a close game. Looks like someone has some catching up to do, but there's still time to do it. 
know that was behind by nine points. It's time for the face-off. Who's playing? Let me see you up front. Yeah, let's do it. We want the magic number, seven answers. All right, let's sweeten the pot a bit. All the point values for this question have been doubled. We took a survey of 100 people, asking them, tell me a nicer way to say someone is dead. Oh no! You got in first. Got it. Survey said, kick the bucket. Well, you hit the target, but it's not a bullseye. The number one answer is still up there. I actually don't know. Can we not even see someone that's dead? Gone to sleep. Okay, sure. Our survey says sleep. This is hard. No points. Is it your time to play or pass? Oh, I want to pass it. No, no. Great, you're going to play. They they said pass. Anyway, they know. I'm gonna need a guess from you. Okie dokie. Three. Let's see if it's there. Six feet under. Ding. Ouch. Sorry. You've earned yourself a strike. Uh oh. It's up to you now. Alright. Let's try it. What? Let's check the board. I have never heard that one. Pushing Daisy. No. Never heard that one. Another oh. strike. Uh -oh. You like I know anything? Tell me a nicer way to say someone is uh -oh. dead. Um. Understood. Let's see if the board's got. Why are they on it? On there. Gone. Dang it. This game is not over yet. Aha. Uh -huh. You look like someone who's got a good guess for us. I only have one. They take it. I'm dead. Stiff. Say it with confidence. That's definitely right there. Let's see it. Stiff. Oh. Ouch. Third strike. Passed away. Yeah. Now it's the other family's turn to take a crack at it. Passed away. It takes just one answer to steal and take home the points. Give me an answer, and if you're right, you get all the points. Give me a wrong one, and, uh, well, you know. Passed away. Ah, uh, yes. Do we have it? Passed away. It's a steal. And they cleaned up again. You missed some answers. Let's see what they are. We come to answer number six. Let's see it. In heaven. Oh. What have we got in five? No longer with us. Show me answer number four. Expired. I want to see number two. You only need you there with that one. Boom. Deceased. That gun didn't think about that one. It's time to check out the current scores. We're in the lead right now. There may be a clear leader now, but things ain't over yet. One more round. Get ready to go full Nick Cage, because it's time for the face-off. Who wants to play? Get over here. 
Let's fly, baby. Top four answers up on the board. We're upping the ante again. All questions are now worth triple. I need 100. We asked 100 people this question. I can get 190 points. I can win. Name a product that's supposed to have a hole in it. A prop. You buzzed in first. No food. But God. Yes. Interesting answer. And our survey says. Donut. There you go. Wowie, number one. Pass or play? Pass. Those folks must be hardened criminals. They stole last time. Now they hope to do it again. Uh, not real. I just don't know anything. All right. Let's hear it. Oh. That's what you think, huh? Is that answer good enough? K-Ring! It's not there, which means you get a strike. Oh my gosh. Get your beauty face on, it's your go! I think I know one, but... A bagel. We have an answer! Is it up there? Let's hope so. Bagel. That's actually up there. It's on the board! Ooh. There's just two answers up there. Cheese. Sure thing. Not all cheese and hoes. Did anyone in the survey say this? Not all cheese and hoes. Cheese. Not all of them. I was up there anyway. You're doing great. Yay. Name a product that's supposed to have a hole in it. Mint! Here we go then. Is it up there? That's right, Terry. Mint! Uh, oh, oh, it's oh. another strike. Think you've got a good answer? Let's hear it. Uh. Okay then. I don't. Our survey said. Tire! No! That's the final answer! Frick! This is what a winning family looks like. It's time to find out who's won the game. And here's our winning team. And at the finish line, it's the Lee family. Y'all were the great players. It's hard to have to say goodbye. Looks like we won't be seeing you playing fast money today. You may be going home early today, but we've still got something for you. We're going to take your final score and turn it into money. I want to thank both our families for coming on Family View. Until next time, save your future. Just be loving. Wanna give this another go? No. No, right, no. But I will real quick play one more game of Wheel of Fortune. I will play one more game of that. Or not one more game. I'll play one today. But I will play one at least one game of that real quickly. I won't be on here that long. Let's do it. Wait for the game to load up. What's, what's 
keep that. But this one's got a loss in Vegas, so let's go to... Let's put, let's put Grease in there. As for the car... Let's try that. Let's not waste too much time. Real quickly, let's play the game. Like I said, we'll play only like one game. And maybe I can hurry up and get back downstairs and maybe I'll do a video on my iPad later. We'll have to see. Let's start the game. Alright. The round cache is quick only after you solve a puzzle. Otherwise, it will be reset to zero at the beginning of the next round. Oh, oh yeah, I kind of knew that one. Game. Ladies and gentlemen, here are the stars of America's Game. Hello everyone, how are you? We've got a big crowd tonight. Let's play. Ooh, here we go. How are you doing today? Well, I'll take that as a break. I'm sure you're ready to get started. It says here, well, it, it doesn't say much. Why don't you tell us about yourself? Hmm, Violent type, I see. Thank you for joining us today. Your outfit looks quite interesting. You must have visited the customization menu. It's time for a toss-up round for $1,000. The category is food and drink. You got it. Salt and pepper. Contestant number two. Go Ca ahead. Cayenne pepper. Well, I don't know how to it's time to start another toss-up round for two thousand dollars. The category is proper name. Contestant number three, your chance to solve. Yeah. Excuse me. Don't hear the freak. I don't even know who the freak that is. No sense in hanging around here. Let's go ahead and get going. Shall we go ahead and start the round? The category is occupation. All right. Contestant number three, you're up first, so take a spin. Are you kidding me? Wow, amazing! One million dollars! Hold on tight to that! Yes, we have some tea. You smart little booger! Pretty happy right now. I know I would be. Six hundred. Do we have any of those? No. I'm sorry. Of course she gets the million dollars. That's crazy. What's making a bank run? That's just about dead. Six fifty. Yes. No, we don't seem to have any of those. Five hundred. Yes, we have some D. Well, that's a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. She got going on the wild card. All right, now she missed it. Ooh. 600. Wow, not a single one on the board. I'm sorry. Do it for a J as well. What a flippin' idiot. I hope you are on a bank of you a million dollar wage. 700. Wow, not a single one on the board. I'm sorry. Oh, oh. 650. F. We have one F. That's a fair bit of cash. They're having nothing, which I could never keep had. Okay, we're good. 
900. But now, R. Yes, we have some R. Director of Not something. Bad. You've got quite a bit of money now. Let's say I'd be director of something. And by director, I don't know what that last word is. Yikes. 900. Yes, we have some C. That's a lot of money you won there. So far, so a vowel, vowel. If you'd like to buy a vowel, you can do that. Oh. Yes, we have some O. Director of... I cannot tell what that word is yet. Oh, 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 800. And we have one N. Not bad. You've got quite a bit of money now. Production. No more spin. I don't mind going bankrupt, and I'm happy. We're good. 650. K. We have one P. Good job. Keep that going. You'll be heading home a winner tonight. Why don't you go ahead and tell us the answer? Direct. Director of Production. There we go. Wow, that is incredible. How did you come up with that? I got it. <laughs> Should I keep smiling for the camera? No? Okay, let's get going. I think it's time to start this round. The category is character. Oh. Contestant number one. Why don't you go ahead and take the first spin? Well, thank you for the offer. Ah, I almost had 600. To, I almost had car the car. We have one key. Don't go and spend all that at once now. I know what I'll do, Dave. I know what I did this game last night. I ended up getting a lot of stuff. Ooh. Wild card. I ended up actually getting over $77,000. Yes, we have some S's. And everything, which is great. As always, I want to remind you that you have the ability to use that wild card. I don't want to, though. If I could take the bonus for him, I will. Ooh. Yes, we have some R. Are you interested in taking a gamble on the mystery wedge? There's a chance you could go bankrupt, but. You also have a chance to win ten thousand dollars. Uh, cause I got a wild card. I won't worry about. It. Well, that's a healthy amount to add. I just want to remind you that you have a chance to use your wild card. Yeah, it might be. I'm trying to save the dollars if I can. Ooh. Yes, we have some M. Could you reach down and pick up that card and go on Dream Stay? A $1,000 gift. As always, I want to remind you that you have the ability to use that wild card. Is he going to let me know what the heck is? Every time I take one spin and just say no to his offer? Six fifty. Uh, something monsters. Yes, we have some M's. Great job. That's quite a bit. Don't forget you have that wild card. Would I don't you like that, to use it? I, I don't know what that first one is, but I know what the last one is. Something monsters. They definitely pocket monsters. 500. Nah, definitely not. Uh. No, we don't seem to have any of those. I don't know what that first word is. We have one G. Wow, that was 
a pretty lucky flip, and you'll be going home soon enough. If you'd like to buy a vowel, will we get any help on this? It seems we're out of luck. Imagine a lost vowel. Five hundred. Unfortunately, Maybe that's is. not what we need. Maybe it is. Maybe we know why. Oh, oh, oh! You hit big with thirty-five hundred dollars. I'm gonna try. Why? We have one. Why? Well, that is a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. Amen. I don't know if it's one If you'd like to buy a vowel, you can do that. I. Yes, we have some I. Amen. 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 I'm not sure. You oh. certainly got the money, so go ahead and tell us which vowel you like. Yes, we have some A. I'm not sure I put imaginary right. I know what the rest of the puzzle is. I'll solve it. Why don't you go ahead and tell us the answer? You got it. Imaginary monsters! I am speechless. Did you just pull that out of thin air? It's time for the prize round. The winner will be getting a special prize on top of the cash. The category is, what are you doing? I wish I could get first on this one. Contestant number two, go ahead and take the first spin. It ain't as I thought it would be. You can hold it too long. Five hundred. We have one page. Don't go and spend all that at once. If you'd like to buy a vowel, we have one Five hundred. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. Why won't there be a Q in there, Dumbo? Six fifty. I'm sorry, there are none on the board. There's no S. Okay, then I will spin Zebia. Seven hundred. Ain't bad. T. We have one T. That's a fair bit of cash. Okay, don't forget you have that wild card. Would you like to use it? I still have that wild card. Now I'm going to get in round two, though, because now I'm going to bank for a bank. Oh, no! I avoid it. Seven hundred. Yes, we have some R. Four. Don't go and spend all that at once now. Just a quick reminder now. You have a wild card and you can use it if you'd like. Uh, again, I'm gonna save it for the bonus round. I think I even get there without winning a bank though. Yeah, never mind. Come on! Let's go! 600. Yeah. We have one F. Great job. That's quite a bit. Just a quick reminder now. You have a wild card and you can use it if you'd like. I buy a vowel. You've certainly got the money, so go ahead and tell us which vowel you'd like. Oh. We have one. Oh. I have more than one. I really did. That's why I went for it. Five fifty. We have one N. Don't go and spend it all out at once now. Don't forget you have that wild card. Would you like to use it? Maybe only on 3500, I'm not going to get the chance. Y'all's going to have I said that. 500. C. We have one C. We need a G. Well, that is a healthy amount. And just a quick reminder now. Have a wild card and you can use it if you like. Again, we really don't know anything. Yeah, that's what I was gonna happen. 
Well, I'm very sorry. Just try to keep positive thoughts now. Uh -huh. That's too bad. Next contestant, it's your turn. Will we get any help on this? It seems we're out of luck. Uh, 800. G. We have one G. Don't go and it all out at once now. Ah! M. Yes, we have some M. Well, that's a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. Some for my team? Cheering? 900. Oh, it is! Cheering for my team, so we need a Y. We have one. Why? That's a fair bit of time to take that. How about we solve? Contestant number one, we solved. Cheering for my team! My Pokemon team, that is! Wow, you made that look easy. Congratulations! You're going to Italy! Hey! Come with us on a trip to Italy and experience the warm and sunny Mediterranean climate, the ancient sites in Rome, and the wonderful food. It's $7,320. This is our $3,000 toss-up round. The category is person. Contestant number one, it's your chance. I'll push it above the end. Famous something. No. Famous. Famous what? Oh my gosh. Famous. Dang it! Hit it. Contestant number two. What's that? Salt. Harvest. I think it's time to start this round. The category is event. Dear me. I'm gonna give the wheel another spin. Yes, we have some old. Contestant number two, would you like to solve? Unfortunately, that's not what we need. T. We have one T. Good job. Keep that going. You'll be heading home a winner tonight. Contestant number one, would you like to solve? I don't know what yet said so now. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. We have one S. Well, that is a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. Contestant number three, your chance to solve. R. We have one R. Don't go have them all out at once now. Contestant number one, your chance to solve. We don't know it yet, so... I'm sorry, there are none on the board.
have one E. Contestant number three, your chance to solve. And no, we don't seem to have any of those. Frick. Yes, we have some A. Contestant number two, your chance to solve. Will we get any help on this? We'll be it seems we're out of luck. Will it, will it be hootenane at one a second word? Or try H. Will we get any help on this? It seems we're out of luck. Nope, it ain't hootenanny. What's this going hootenanny? You have one. Four vowels. Summer! I don't know what that is. Second word. Contestant number two, your chance to solve. I can see that one word of summer. Yes, we have some L. Summer football game! I guess you'll be playing for dinner tonight. Contestant number three, would you like to solve? She don't know it, I know it. So, M. Yes, we have some M. Good job! Keep that going and you'll be heading home a winner tonight. Contestant number one, would you like to solve? Summer football. Never mind, it ain't game. Ah. Uh. What? I don't know what that third word. I don't know what that. I don't know what's game, but they G. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. What is that second word? What third word? We have one C. Don't go and spend all that at once. Now. Contestant number three, your chance to solve. Football camp. We have one F. Don't go and spend all that at once now. Contestant number one, your chance to solve. It's not camp. Oh, there it is. There's the key. There we go. Got it. Wow, that is incredible. How did you come up with that? Let's get started with the bonus rounds. Oh yeah, let's do it. Please follow me over here. Yes, let's do it. People. Contestant, we will give you the typical letters R, S, T, L, N, and E. Could we have three consonants and a vowel, please? C, D, I'll do, I'll wait, G. I'll do G and have a G. Wow, you made that look easy. Okay, time is limited, so solve the puzzle. Griping? Unfortunately, you didn't win the bonus round. You're not going home empty handed. Oh, man. 
behind you. Yeah. What? What's that cheat? Do it. I did say I won't do more. Boy, we leveled up. Is that what we've gotten every time? Let's play one more and use Italy. And may the host. Uh, it's me. It would be on the set, wouldn't it? Yeah, it is. Yes, I like that. Let's go and get that Italy trip. There it is. We're gonna go to Italy. Again, we'll try for that car again. But this time, we'll switch this over to. Let's do this one. Maybe we should also turn the music down again so we can actually hear what the announcer is saying. I mean, the host. Uh. Options. Let's try that. That way we can actually hear the host a little bit more. This will definitely be the only game, oh, the rest of the last game we're gonna do on here. Let's just do one more. Toss up round requires you to buzz in sauce and get ready and buzz in as soon as you figure out the answer. Don't let the opportunity slip away. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for tonight's host? Yes, we are. Hello, everyone. How are you? Good to see so many people here. I hope you're all well. Let's do it. Thank you for joining us today. Your outfit looks quite interesting. You must have visited the customization menus. It says here, well, it, it doesn't say much. Why don't you tell us about yourself? Hmm, silent type, I see. How are you doing today? Well, I'll take that as a great. I'm sure you're ready to get started. Let's start a toss-up round for $1,000. The category is food and drink. Let's play. Something cooked. Contestant number I two, go ahead. I pressed the A button and didn't do it. It's time to start another toss-up round for $2,000. The category is Bing. Frick, 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 frick. Oh. Contestant number one, your chance to solve. High heel cheese. There you go. Well, I think it's time to take our places. The contestants are ready to start. Let's go ahead and start the round. The category is food and drink. Right. Contestant number one, you're up first, so take a spin. Let's do it. <laughs> With the free play, you've got a second chance at this. I'm going to do a vowel. All right. You can certainly buy a vowel. What would you like? A. Yes, we have some A. I think we got that. That worked. Although, I really need some money. 
Not really based on the wow. I mean, I'm taking the penalty. 500. Alright. T. I'm sorry, there are none on the board. There was legitimately no T in the puzzle. Ah! 650. We have one R. Alright. That's a fair bit of cash you picked up. That's about as painful as bankruptcy gets. The little money you get earned, you lost, which is great. I'm sorry, there are none on the board. Wow, all wow, the more colors are in these puzzles. Or this puzzle. What no T, what no N. Can I get it too badly? I might. Prize. S. Yes, we have some S's. You can pick up that. <laughs> Unfortunately, it looks like you won't be going home with that today. Come on, let's go! 900! Unfortunately, that's not what we need. Come on, let's go! 600! Will we get any help on this? It seems we're out of luck. Yes, so am I. Yes, and all of you never get it anyway. Oh, have we got it? Wow, twenty-five hundred dollars. C. We have one C. Don't go and spend all that at once now. Eight hundred. H. We have one H. Great job. That's quite a bit of cash in your pocket now. Yeah, now, again, if I just keep it, I had that true and I lost it instantly when I got it. 550. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. I kind of thought first one was hamburger for some reason. I don't know why hamburger. I don't think hamburger is spelled the way it's on screen. Dang. Ouch. The bankrupt wedge is always a painful one. Especially when you actually have something. You didn't have anything, so basically you're just going to lose a turn wedge for you. This is close. 650. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. He just said a Z. What are you a flippin' idiot? It's too close. 700. We have one B. Hey. Good job. Keep that going. You'll be heading home a winner tonight. Hey, that'd be great. If I can keep it right now. Body, body, body. Wow, I am very sorry. Just try to keep positive thoughts now. No one's earning any money even for money on bankrupt. Yikes! Or 600. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. Or piggy still money like that. Ouch! Bankrupt is always a painful one.
700. Uh, J? We have one G. They shoot at something. Don't go and spend all that at once now. Oh, are you serious? Just didn't make it this time. I'm sorry. I get out of there. I get angry in this game screen. Nine hundred. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. With your free play, you aren't out of it yet. What vowel would you like? We have one here. Come on, let's go! 600. Wow, not a single one on the board. I'm sorry. And yes, we have some M. Don't go and spend all that at once now. Homemade sugar. I don't know what that last one is. Oh, it's got it. Ouch. The bankrupt wedge is always a painful one. Everybody's getting so we can't earn any money. Six hundred. Wow, not a single one on the board. I'm sorry. Yes. Ouch. Bankrupt is always a painful one. Dang, come on, man. Everybody's getting along good at bankrupt. We're guessing stupid letters. Are we gonna make it? Nope. 650. Okay. Will we get no! any help? No! It seems we're out of luck. Georgia's money on it! 600. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. Please, I'm not trying to get this free. If I lose this, then it's the game's problem. Are you going to hit it? No, we don't seem to have any of those. He messed it up! Please do not win on bankrupt! I don't know, friends are really living there. Five hundred. We have one K. Good job. Oh. Keep that going, and you'll be heading home a winner tonight. How my sugar cookies? If you think you know the answer, please go ahead. Home made sugar cookies. Wow, that is incredible! How did you come up with that? No sense in hanging around here. Let's go ahead and get going. Let's go ahead and start the round. The category is Thing. Contestant number two, why don't you go ahead and take the first spin? Seven hundred. We have one G. Good job. Keep that going. You'll be heading home a winner tonight. If you really don't want to be a winner, I want you to lose. I don't care about this. Oh, no. You got out of it. 900. No, we don't seem to have any of those. No. Wild Puck. You don't need that either. We have one. Beat. 
You can pick up that wild card. Keep moving, keep moving. 900. We have one beef. I guess you'll be paying for dinner tonight. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. Dang, I really need something good to happen for me. Oh, crap. Okay, that's not bad. With your free play, you aren't out of it yet. If you'd like to buy a vowel, you've got the cash, so what would you like? Hey. We have one A. So if I get this, I'm going for work. We have one S. I'm going to go for a T. This is a bit interesting now. There's a chance at winning $10,000 if you flip the wedge, but you're risking all your winnings and could go bankrupt. What would you like to do? I don't have any winnings, so if I get a bankrupt, it has nothing effect, no effect on me. Ouch. <laughs> the bankrupt wedge is always a painful one. See what I mean? Sure, you can buy a vowel. Yes, we have some holes. If you'd like to buy a vowel, we have one U. Oh my gosh! Yikes! Six hundred. Yes, we have some L. Don't go and spend all that at once now. Well, I'm bankrupt, you daggum idiot. Okay, so there's a mailing on bad cash, so you can go in on bad cash. No, who gives them? I'm sorry, there are none on the board. Well, she didn't get it, but... Sure, you can buy a vowel. Yes, we have some E. $1,000. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. $650. Tea. Yes, we have some tea. Not bad. You've got quite a bit of money now. Yeah, now I can't find just keep it for me. That's not actually get somewhere. Wow, I'm very sorry. Just try to keep positive thoughts now. How? How do you keep positive thoughts? You can certainly buy a vowel. Yes, we have some eyes. So, I know it is. I know it is. I just need to be able to get the positive. I get my turn back. 650. Yes, we have some ends. Well, that is a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. Oh, come on! We have one car. I know you must be excited to go hop in that car and drive, but we still have some of the show left, so hang on. I'm gonna do a bankrupt so badly. I swear to you, I'm million dollars. Almost yes! there. So sorry. You need to take that back from you. Good. You don't deserve anything. They won't give me anything. So you don't deserve anything. Almost there. Six fifty. We have one C. Good job! Keep that going and you'll be heading home a winner tonight. Contestant number three, please solve.
Wow, that is incredible. How did you come up with that? We have a prize round now. The winner will be picking up something extra today. The category is food and drink. Contestant number three, you're up first, so take a spin. Six fifty. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. That's a good thing. Now, game, can I quickly earn some money? Ooh, oh, no, no. 500. We have one team. I guess you'll be paying for dinner tonight. Nope, you can't wait an hour ago. It's a free play. You have a free play, so take another spin. Sure, you can buy a vowel. What would you like? And there is an I in there, boss. Yes, about? we have some A's. Oh, I know it ain't this. So I'm actually glad I didn't go there. What in the world is that about? Not one more it weird. Yikes. Six hundred. Yes, we have some S's. Good job. Keep that going, and you'll be heading home a winner tonight. If I can get lucky, if I do, it will be one of the cash rounds I had before. I go on my class. I am. I like that sound. Do we have any of those? No. I'm sorry. I like that sound. <laughs> Five fifty. Unfortunately, there are none on the board. I'm sorry. Aha! Just didn't make it this time. I'm sorry. Now you deserve it. Seven hundred. L. We have one L. So that last one's salad. That's a fair bit of cash you picked up. We have one B. Go ahead and pick up the card from Razor. A one thousand dollar gift. Five hundred. And we have one in. Well, that is a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. I do not know what that third word is. I only know that first word. We have one C. Wow, good job. Hang on tight and that card could be yours. I'm gonna buy a vowel. Sure, you can buy a vowel. What would you like? E? We have one E. What? I can buy another vowel? If you'd like to buy a vowel, you can do that. We have one I don't know what this is. I don't know what the hell this is. Five hundred. Spinach. We have one. But what is that? What is that third word there? Not bad. You've got quite a bit of money now. I have a place in the where I might think, think about for a minute and see what we got. Oh my! Yes! With your free play, you aren't out of it yet.
we have one F. Well, nice. that's a healthy amount to add to your winnings tonight. I know what it is. Are you ready to solve, contestant number one? Spinach and feta salad. Wow, you made that look easy. Congratulations, you're going to Italy. Come with us on a trip to Italy and experience the warm and sunny Mediterranean climate, the ancient sites in Rome, and the wonderful food. It's $7,320. Are we ready for another toss-up round? The amount is $3,000. And the category is things. Oh boy. Contestant number two, your chance to solve. So easy. Oh, okay. I think it's time to start this round. The category is people. That is not that big of a puzzle. Okay, one short I'll one give one. the wheel one last spin. That one's just gonna be Carly and Larson. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. We're gonna hear now a lot because we don't. There's not many words in there. Yes, we have some tea. Honestly, I got anything in there. Not bad. You've got quite a bit of money now. Contestant number one, would you like to solve? I'm sorry, there are none on the board. Wow, not a single one on the board. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh, again, it's going to take forever. Yes, we have some S's. How am I actually getting these letters? I don't know. Good job. Keep that going and you'll be heading home a winner tonight. Contestant number one, your chance to solve. Wow, not a single one on the board. I'm sorry. Unfortunately, that's not what we need. We have one R. I guess you'll be paying for dinner tonight. And dinner has Contestant number one, would you like to solve? No, what is it? No, we don't seem to have any of those. <laughs> that lady's face when she does that, it's kind of weird looking. Yes, we have some E's. I am so confused on what this actually is. Contestant number three, your chance to solve. Teamster, what is that? Wow, that is incredible. How did you come up with that? And now the winner will follow me for the bonus round. Now we really got anything that huge. The most ounce, fifteen thousand out of that. That's nothing, man. Would you follow me over here, please? Place. There are six letters we can give you. R, S, T, L, N, and E. Let's see what kind of help you can get. Could we have three consonants and a vowel, please? I'll go my usual. C. D. H. A. Wow, you made that look easy. Shade something it. Shaded picnic area! No. Shady picnic area. Time is short, so get ready to solve. Shady picnic area. Oh my gosh, I'll pick forever. Picnic area. Wow, you won the bonus round. And the prize is. 
think you'll be happy with this one. Yeah! That was not that big of a game compared to me. That one, yeah, it's got forty-nine thousand dollars, but nobody had a had that good of a had that good of an amount of money. Wow. All right, guys. Well, I'm gonna go end off this video. I was planning on doing one game. I actually did more than I thought I was going to. I'm gonna go and quit. All right. Well. I know it's hard for you guys to see me, but I'm gonna go and tell you something real quick. Actually, I'm gonna go and fix the brightness while I'm sitting here anyway. I'm gonna fix this real quick. That way, if I want to do another video in a little bit, I can. Well, I'm gonna go and tell you real quickly, guys, right now, that there is not even a complete guarantee I'm gonna be going down after this video is over. In fact, you guys may see a whole nother video and. A few minutes because I'm being stuck up here. I don't know. Cause my mom was telling me earlier when I was playing Family Feud. Apparently we're not gonna have. Well, apparently our internet keeps going in and out. Like I said, I, th I think we can still do. It. I think we can still do a little bit of storm if I think about if I really want to. But here's the thing. I gotta upload this video to YouTube eventually. Then I gotta wait this computer cool down. I don't think. I mean, it doesn't feel that hot. But I don't know if I want to risk anything stupid. I don't know if I want to or not. We'll have to see, guys. I'll see you, Hans, when I get back down there. If I even do. Like I said, I don't know if the internet's gone out yet. or I don't know if the internet's still out or not. I'm going to end off the video, and I'll see you all, guys. I'll see you guys for the next one. It's either be a Castle Crush video, which I don't know if there's a chance of that, thanks to the internet going out. Or I'll do... Oh, that's mostly play. Maybe we'll be able to get both done. I don't know. We'll have to see. Anyway, guys, that's all I got for this video. Until next time, everyone, I want you guys to be the very best, like no one ever was, and I'll see you guys for the next video. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye, everyone.